Oh yeah. About, about two inches of solid ice. Alright guys, welcome back to another adventure with Skylar and Lynn. Um, this is a continuation of mine that a lot of people have already seen a bunch in other videos of mine, Aqua Triggers, Adventures for Life, but no one has been over there yet. You either need a rubber dinghy, always, or ice, which we haven't had a lot of, hopefully right now. I hate editing. It takes forever. Oh look, it's finally done. You may talk about your cities and all the towns you know With trolley cars and pavements hot and theaters where you go you can have your little auto and carriages so fine, but it's hobnail boots and a flannel shirt in Cobalt Town for mine. For we'll sing a little song of Cobalt. If you don't live there, it's your fault. Oh, you Cobalt, where the wintry breezes blow, where all the silver comes from, and you live a life and then some. Oh, you cobalt, you're the best old town I know. Oh shit. Oh, my feet are gonna be wet. <gasps> Fuck this shit. We already have a couple pencils, Skylar was doing while I was setting up. And the ice is good to the point over there, as far as I can typically normally see. So, we're gonna get over there and hopefully come out the other side somewhere. Anyways, okay, guys, so. Up there is the open slope I was talking about. You can see it's like a big huge opening over here. That's the view we get from the camera that's sitting right there. And straight up above me basically. Well, it's about 10 feet that way. She's pretty much a little bit behind her. <laughs> but right up there, I'm guessing four to, maybe four to 10 feet I'll even say of ground. So this is like not the best place to be standing. It never cooperates this fucking thing. One of these times pushing the button though, it will tell me how far that is. There we go. Wanna take guesses? How far is that? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna say 45. No. What do you think? I don't know. 75, 80? You pretty much nailed it. 68. I'm gonna see if you can see this on the screen. Usually it's, a, oh you got it. So 68.369 feet. All right. Oh yeah, you can walk anywhere on that puddle. Yeah, it's not even deep enough to worry about that there. No, and plus two inches plenty. As long as it's not white ice, you're good. Yeah, this feels like normal solid shit to me. And plus, he's checking like every what four feet or something. It looks like a turn right there, maybe both directions, or maybe not. Yeah, I think we're, even though if we do fall through anywhere, the bomb's right there, I can see it. Oh yeah. This is gonna be good. See light coming down from the heavens above that other little hole up there. <laughs> I just sprayed myself there. Every time you hit ice with a fucking hammer. It comes back into your face every time. <laughs> Ceiling looks a okay all right here, like it's smooth and solid. All right, look. So this might. Well, I'm gonna check the ice for this. It looks. It's nice and thick underneath. You can see it here. You can see that crack there. Yeah. yeah but yeah. once we get out there, see where it's nice and white there. That would be perfect right there. Nice and solid over there. Yeah. Plus the snow gives us a bit of a take a bit of our weight off the actual ice too, eh? Yeah. That's how it works. Man, this is also, guys, for anyone wondering, the first test for my Wizard V, whatever it is, <laughs> that my buddy Mike told me to buy. He's like, you won't regret it. And uh, Talia, it's not like, it's not gonna do every single thing you wish a light would do, but like compared to my old floodlight, it's pretty awesome light so far. 
<laughs> He's purposely falling through the ice here just to show that it's on bottom. Yeah, no, no. Making sure it's, that he's actually on bottom there. He's also flooding it for us. That's in our winter boots. Yeah, if you want to stay dry, just stick right here. I'm just going to try to turn it a little stupid mount thing to get it more low. I think something like that's pretty good. Flatten it like it's a fucking rink. There's multiple layers of fucking ice, man. There's a layer, this layer, there's a layer hanging underneath, underneath this one, there's another layer underneath the up that's like, holy fuck. That's a, you want to just stay dry, I'd just stay over here. Fucking light. Anyone want to send me a new light? Look at this fucking thing. This little piece of shit. Hit the button 20 times for it to be melting and all of a sudden does something on its own. Oh yeah, we're good. Hold up for a sec. We're good. Just when you hear the crack, and it's just his cracks extending, I just want to make sure. Oh, it's solid here. It's nice and dry over here. He's been saying that since the start. <laughs> yeah, so he's been saying that since the start. Oh, it's good. It's good. It is though. You're not lying. We're good though. You don't have to. If you're following me, I'll tell you to wait if you need to. <laughs> We're good. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I mean, I'm just feeling if it's doing anything under my feet as I go. It's not right now, like you said, it is solid. Okay. What do we got here? This is fucking awesome. <laughs> I'd follow the edges. <laughs> Hang on. Oh, I felt like I was falling off an edge there. Let's check that real quick. Okay, a lot of times there is like a layer of ice water in the ice that's yeah. thick. The ceiling's all really good in here. I've been checking too, so you all know. No, it's like, fuck man. Is there a hole somewhere I can throw this bitch down? I hate it. I, it actually, we need it to see, but it really sucks because it ruins a bunch of parts of my videos. So, I am looking at getting a better light that, you know, can at least keep its electricity pulses in check with like a 60 hertz system, so that you don't get a stupid flickering all the time. You have to restart it, because when it restarts, it starts at 60 hertz, but it's probably really like 59 and three quarters. So after it's on for like five minutes, it's out of time with the fucking light. Anyways, people don't understand how fucking lights and shit works. They're going to be like, what's he talking about? I'm talking about this piece of shit. Solid over here. Oh, fuck yeah. I think he's going that way. That's not where we're trying to head you, but we will check it first, because yeah, it's dry land. Hopefully. There's something here anyway. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Hit the button three times that time, by the way. Ooh, look at the false floor right up there. Hey, it goes to some workings. Look up there, man. <laughs> some guy walks across it. <laughs> There's something, I don't know. Huh. Coming? That's freaking cool. Anyways, see, it's all solid up there. So That's what I was actually checking, and I noticed the floor. Did you see it up there? Probably both see it. Oh yeah, the wood, pieces of wood. Yeah. I find those things are awesome. The more places we get, the better. He's getting way ahead of us. <laughs> nah, it's probably like a 90 Spalding or something. <laughs> Rawlings maybe. First spot, I touch my pinpointer to the ground, it beeps. Think it's silver? I do. I don't think that's all iron. Eyeball that one. This one's beeping here. Um, no, that's a leaf thing. 
so frozen you can't even see. Oh, there's gonna be nickel in there. You can see a little bit of green probably, a very slight tinge of it. It'll be nickel in. Could be silver with it, but that's pretty crazy for just, I touched it like, it's the first time I touched the dirt in here. Uh, no point in coming this way. What? No point in going this way, there's no drift. No point in going that way, it's dead end. I gotta get my nugget before I leave this spot. <laughs> First spot I touch the pinpointer down is what's coming out of it. <laughs> Even if it's just cobalt, whatever. No, it's too heavy to be just cobalt. Fuck yeah, it's awesome. Man, this, oh yeah, I know it's a good piece. I need to see that enough. Fuck, that's awesome. Holy shit. <laughs> Fuck. Did you walk straight across this? You went around, eh? Did you fucking fly there? How'd you get over there? It's cracking every step. See that? I know there's a layer and then there's ice under it, so I don't care. I'm just showing you. Stop walking away, man. I'm trying to do a big un unveiling here. <laughs> uh, for real, watch this. This is what was beeping there. <laughs> Feel how heavy that is. Not much staining. It's gonna be heavy on the silver side. Oh yeah. There's not much pink, not much green. So that weight's gonna be silver. Burger mass. Totally worth it to me. You guys are probably like, what the fuck's he doing? I made, I made like a trail where it's thick and where it's thin, so I like I, I checked so we fucking follow my steps. <laughs> Whatever works. We'll go that way and see what we can get to. <laughs> Okay. Did you try going this way? Yeah, no, I was just curious if you checked it or whatever. Because it looks cool, like, just looking at it. I don't know how much you can see on video right now. That new light's pretty awesome, but... Let's see if we can get a bit more in there. You can see what's going on. It goes back pretty far. There's ridiculous awesome icicles there. Looks like a shaft right up there too, dropping into it. Maybe not. <laughs> One step closer and it's like, crack. Oh, you went this way. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm thinking when you take one of those two. If I'm remembering right, it's probably that one. Oh, this is a good, good adventure. Good timing for it. This is, <laughs> Pretty much, anyway. Could be a little colder the last few days instead, but it's been cold for a couple days again after like a one warm day. You guys still recording? Have you been checking on that and stuff? Check this out. Oh, there's a spot to give me a boost up. <laughs> oh, there's an opening up there to outside. Oh, <laughs> is that thing still rolling? I don't think it is. Look at this thing going all stupid. Two. Three, three clicks again. Ooh, oh, there's a bit of a floor. Of course. That's awesome. I'm gonna get right down there. Even the spot that's cracked above the timbers is like a foot, over a foot thick. Yeah, like where you're standing look, down. Yeah, but look at this. Look. It, it looks like it goes down at least 20 feet. At least. <clears throat> I can see the bottom here. Yeah. You can see two, awesome. two timbers. <laughs> it looks like there's something green glowing over here, but it's just the wall lit up. Yeah, but come over here, you can see more. <laughs> Better over here, it's clear. Let me get there, man. Yeah, but look. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> wait, hold up, hold up. Before I look down, let's look up, because see all these rocks on here? <laughs> Where'd they come from? Oh, just a little, little bit of stuff. We're good. But like that, could have fucking hurt. 
Oh fuck. Ow, motherfucker. These ones make ticking sounds and they bounce off your helmet. Hey Ty, stop doing that. Anyways. I can see the bottom right here. It's more clear over here. Oh yeah? yeah. <laughs> it reminds me of like a fucking glass top of like an aquarium that you can walk on and see fish swimming under you, but I don't see anything swimming. I'm over here and see this from here. That's pretty sweet. Oh, and then the light fell. I'll fix it up though. <clears throat> see, this is the kind of thing Mike would do and then he would take a picture. Can you go up that way? No. Seriously. No. It's like fucking it's like that. <laughs> <laughs> I got my mountain goat boots on. <laughs> that is pretty freaking cool though. <laughs> yeah guys, another one of those world famous hopefully one day after more than five people watch my videos, ice knobs. Maybe that's why no one watches my videos, I talk about ice knobs. I wonder if it shuts off if I set it on the ice again. It does. Um. Easiness factor, I don't know. It's not that bad, but everything's pretty not. This is gonna be slippery, that's icy. But otherwise, I'll maybe go around this way. Yeah, it's not icy at least. It's the same as in the summer for this shit. Okay, can this light like a... <laughs> that's what's the problem. She's standing there going, what the fuck am I holding this for? Oh, this light, man. I'm gonna fucking hook it one day. I guess we're probably not gonna be able to make it up there. <laughs> I don't know. I can't tell from here yet. <laughs> oh, I can make it up there. I don't know if you can get out up there though. I can walk up that easy enough. Easier than what that looks. Feeling solid. You can see a bit of a vein up there too. Not much. Some of them are way more pronounced, like from a distance. Try to go first on this. Oh man, there's like a big rock you can go under. Yeah. <laughs> it's getting deeper down though than that 75 feet. Mm. That's all super thick too, so you'd be good on that. It's not that deep either to the bottom. There's probably ice right to the bottom. Holy fuck, this is sick. This is like a false floor up there. I don't know how good that's showing up. But wait, let me think about turning on the light and it just turned itself on. <laughs> so you can see that shit. <laughs> Quit breathing, Ty. I'll be able to see better. <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. Alright. Um, straight this way, I guess. I'm actually looking for stuff too, not just where we can go. That's why I'm a little slower. If I find silver in a pile, I gotta check around it because usually for one piece, there's more. If you don't care about it, I understand, but if you do, you gotta pinpoint her out. you be sticking up, they'll fucking flow all day just like me. That's a big pillar, that's awesome. That looks icy to me. I'm gonna check the snow. Maybe stickier. It might be ice too. It's just a layer. There you go, Lynn. You'll get grip on her. Ah. Yeah. I should have bashed the top of that rock off better. Here I will. Just so you can hang on to it. I'm gonna look around anyways, but. Oh. 
If you do decide to come down here, you better have something that's not ice to grab on you. <coughs> Especially when it's the only thing around. That way it goes at the same kind of like, Yeah, we're asked right. you about. Makes sense. Yeah, that's <coughs> oh no man. Dust blowing in again. Like, that's thick as fuck. Look at that. Dude. Like, so fucking good. light. Why do you shut off and you touch the fucking ice? <laughs> it makes no sense. Look how thick that is. It's like two feet there. If anything, find a spot that has an obvious crack, sweep the dirt off of her, just light up the crack and you can see how far down it goes. <laughs> oh, this is sweet. This is definitely a rubber dinghy bull though. There's no metal bars sticking up. There's no big branches. It's awesome. Once it's all melted, pfft. Watch. That's your... I'm good, I can see the leaves at least four inches down right here. Oh man. I am really peaked about that one. <laughs> Looks easy enough to go up. This still isn't the big hole though. Like I know it's... <laughs> yeah. You coming then? This is safe down here. Yeah. It is. Else. Yeah, no, it's good. I mean, you can see leaves that are at least three or four inches down, you know it's gonna be good because there's definitely ice they're sitting on. Leaves don't float when they're wet. Does that look really yellow to you straight ahead up there on that big pillar? Does that look really yellow up there to you? Like, <clears throat> right up in there? It does. Hey? Yeah. I wonder why? Is this all safe? Yeah. Oh, there. At least around the corner. Yeah, there is a floor up there, yeah. Yeah, it's good. The ceiling's good, too. That's friggin' light, man. <laughs> it's like it's egging me on. Yeah. I... I wanna go up these fuckers. Oh yeah, we're all good. I guess we could have just came in there instead. At least we know going out we could. If we don't explore more shit. So this one just heads up that way. They probably run parallel and they might connect together somewhere. They might not, but since we're here, <clears throat> someone tossed a water ball from up on the top. Is it? That's a big stope, the old false floor up above you. As far as you can see from where you are, that's as far as it goes. Yeah, eh? Yeah. It's a big stope up there. There's gonna be silver down here. Somewhere. There. There's my gas, wherever that beep was. I moved it too fast. <laughs> I'll let you go by and check. Where are ya? <laughs> you should stick by me. Every time you're close by, I get beeps on this thing. <laughs> Go home with a bunch of silver. Wins my lucky charm. Where is it though? That one. <laughs> Told you I was a nice bean up there. <laughs> I can't really hear what he's saying, but he knows what he's talking about. <laughs> eh? No, I've done it before. I've done this before a lot. But you gotta think too, everywhere in Cobalt freezes this, like this. And like, I don't stop playing around because <laughs> it's awesome. It's almost like another ballroom, but it's an open stove. Did you hear the crack? Is that you? No, I heard it again right there. That's water falling, man. I think it was, I think it was just your uh, beeper. It could be this. Yeah, see, 
It did it. It's echo. That was a really sharp echo from not a very sharp sound. You gotta look up before you do stuff like it's gonna make a big echo in these places though. Like that piece right there makes me go, why is that so thin in the same fucking thickness as a piece of vein? Is it worth going to? It definitely is because it's thick as shit, but. <laughs> oh fuck. Top layer. <laughs> Anyways, okay. Back to the game plan. We should see if there's a spot that we can get out somewhat into the middle of a clear spot that's really thick and get the light down that doesn't have an opening above it to dirty it up. <laughs> we need new lights for that. <laughs> this thing's fucking junk. But no. Here, you know what? How about you just man this light? fucking work. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna see. It's getting thin here. Teardrop <laughs> open stope. <laughs> I'm lighting up everything, but what do you want us to look at? <laughs> uh, I'll catch up to him. I tried to give you the fucking thing. See that crack only goes down part way. You can see air bubbles down there. See that? Crazy, that's like two feet down. <laughs> can you see those? That's freaking nuts. <laughs> There's a leaf suspended way down there. That was awesome. Sorry for the hold up, but give me one sec. I gotta wipe this off. <clears throat> Air bubbles frozen in time. Look at that. That's at least two feet thick. At least. You see the depth of them bitches? <laughs> Where's that leaf? There it is. Well, there's some there you are over foot. But trail of air bubbles. Turn on you bastard. <laughs> and turn this fucking thing off. Oh my fucking god. Don't touch it to the ice. How's that? See strings of air bubbles, eh? You gotta get the right angle to actually see them really good. Yeah, look at that. That's awesome. It's like ferns growing up over there, like corals. That's what it looks like. Bubbles of corals. Don't worry, the crack part of the ice is eight inches thick and it's still solid ice under <laughs> for like four feet. <laughs> this is insane, man. We're getting there, we're getting there. What's this about? That's fucking strange. Well, it's probably something dripping onto it. There's a water falling over there. Probably just some shit that <clears throat> melted and pulled up the other day. Look at the fucking strings of air bubbles, that's awesome. Yeah, could just be like a, a overhang, like these kinds of things. It might take right off there, you know. That's crazy. Can you see those? Isn't that sick? It looks like corals of bubbles, that's crazy. Whatever works. So what are we looking at around the corner? There's nothing there. Nothing? Get away from me, motherfucker. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> you don't need to hold hands though. That's a little too close for my comfort. I'm gonna wipe off my all ends cover just in case you get my fucking dirty. I'm not worried about that. Oh, fucking light. I want to check this little area because just. Oh no, I can still see down at least six inches. There's something frozen down there, leaves. Anyway. I don't know what he's fucking around with there, but. Yeah, these weird spots is probably just from pooled water when some shit melted and it changes the color of it. But you never know, so we stay away from them.
<laughs> yeah, I'm gonna. This is your hammerhead, eh, right there? Yeah, you're good. That was probably water dripping. Yeah, I'm not worried. I'm just trying to slow down a little for the videos because a lot of times it's like I'm all over the fucking place. Like I get disoriented watching your videos. I get vertigo watching your videos. Watch them in slow motion then. <laughs> They got the majority of it out of there, man. There's only one little spot. Look out, look out. Hmm? You fucking... Do you, do you like put your flashlight over there and you step away from it? Fuck, I, I just saw shit. It goes in like good friend feet. Yeah, we'll check it out in a sec. Just, uh... I don't know what this room used to be. I know they didn't blast open this part. I know this is the original part of the mine, eh? All under here is all original workings, yeah, yeah. But yeah, like, see how the water's running down there? I would not do that even at all over there just because that can loosen the top up. But I do want to look that way because if the snow keeps going, that's a flat wall. <clears throat> Let's see what we can see in the ice. <laughs> it's ridiculous because the top la top layer cracks, right? <laughs> but it's frozen separately than the layer under it because those bubbles would be moving and hitting the bottom of this layer of ice if it wasn't solid. It's so clear. I'm calling all the window fish. <laughs> the Chinese window fish. Where are you fishies? Come to my light. <laughs> Yeah, it, it, it kind of looks like there might be a wall there. It's hard to say, eh? It's deep. The ice, you can see there's like at least three layers of ice. Top layer, that's the cracking one because it's the one that's exposed to temperature changes. It's about six to eight inches, right? You can see the edge of it. You can see the bottom of the ice, man. You but <laughs> you can see bubbles all the way. That tells you that's frozen the whole way and it's just yeah. different layers. Because if not, the bubbles would be coming up and going like this at the bottom six, of this layer. It's like a six inch layer here and then it goes straight down. Water. There's a row of bubbles that are yeah. stationary at least three feet. That's awesome. That's ridiculous. Look, eh? look at the cork and melts the ice. Oh yeah, that thing gets hot. Oh fuck. With this much ice you got nothing to worry about. Go hold a fucking pickup truck. <laughs> oh yeah, I would hold a dump truck to haul or out. Hear vehicles outside? Huh? Hear vehicles outside? Vehicle? No. I did, like a truck or something. Well, they're pretty close to me. To stuff. Beep, beep. That water is finding a crack and it's over time it opened up bigger and it could potentially drop stuff. I would go around it for sure, happily. I just would not stand under where that water could push something out onto you. Because that's basically, ba basically that is what happens in the spring that causes problems. Yeah, yeah. But like, it's not gonna hurt you over here. It won't hurt you over there. It's only gonna hurt you if you're where shit's gonna fall and hit you. Otherwise, fuck, why does this light do this to me? Yeah, I get that. The ice isn't the problem. The fact there's no hole, the water's coming down up there is the problem. And if there was a hole and water's coming down, it's still a problem. I'm more worried about slipping on a slippery spot. Like this is grippy, that is slippery. <laughs> I'm more worried about like whoosh, anything else. Some stalls up there. You went by there. Is it dead end? <laughs> oh, it is open, but still, you don't want to be by the edge of that shit. Well, you can see the vein right there in the face. So let's go find the silver in it. A little slushy from the water, but oh, yeah. fuck me, this fucking ice. <laughs> Touch it to the ice. It's not even wet ice. Oh, yeah, it's super thick. You see the veins? Mm -hmm. That's what I've been saying. But yeah, check it out, guys. I gotta shut up because the fucking <laughs> the moisture. I'm speaking moistly. The Prime Minister wouldn't be too proud of me right now. I gotta shut up though, so the conversation quits floating up in front of the camera. Okay, guys, check out the vein. <laughs> Hold my breath. Is 
Same as always, let's check it out. <laughs> What's that flat little timber from? Alright. Neat. <clears throat> so, we've got some uh, circular stones and the bedrock. <laughs> Calcite, no silver. I gotta follow it to find out though. So the water dripping's like right up there in front of me. I don't know if you could see splashes. And then the faceless dope I'm guessing is pretty much, yeah it is right back there. Irony. And the walls and it is open stope, see? So the water is coming off the sides, which isn't as bad as through crack really, but that means that the top edges is getting thawed out and can just make thaw out a rock that's it was broken apart or whatever by the freeze. The ice holds it, thaws, it falls off because nothing's holding it. Do some social distancing behind them there, just like six feet or whatever, just in case. But even if you, if there was like a layer of water, you're only gonna drop however many inches it is to the next layer of ice. But your feet will be fucking drenched, and I would be not happy if it was myself. <laughs> Obviously, <laughs> I'd be like, you fucking win, motherfucker. <laughs> now I'm going home. Any veins in here? Yeah, right in the corner. I'm gonna check them real quick. You guys are good without me for a sec. All right, I'm not gonna be long unless I find awesomeness. Drill holes. You gotta poke them. What's well, not? Maybe they're misfires. Oh, it is too. This is alcohol. I shouldn't be poking sticks in there. M I S. Close enough. Not. I think we're too low in the vein system to have any good, any good chunks. It makes me very curious how far straight down it is under this ice. So. I'm gonna drill holes on auger. You get a fucking thirty foot ice auger. <laughs> Freeze before you drill through. <laughs> Oh, look at outside. Is it okay if we start heading back? Yeah, yeah. Whatever you guys want to do. She, she want, she, she's going to tangle. Yeah, that's all right, man. Both, yeah. Can't wait till it's spring. Well, we'll check this last second out right here, and then, and then we'll cut her back. Yeah, back's that way, right? Yeah. Mm. If it's easy enough to go over the side, might as well. Yeah, see that was awesome, man. So cool. Right down that whole pillar. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, my feet are gonna be wet. <gasps> Fuck this shit. <laughs> Not yet, but I might. I went up like, oh yeah, I'm getting wet. Where do you guys go from here? Out that way or this side? I was too busy looking up <laughs> and I stepped on a soft spot and went up to the wall. You see where the water line is on my pants? Kind of like a trail up right there. <laughs> I was so close, right there. Oh, there I go. <laughs> you found the spot too. <laughs> oh shit, right around here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm already soaked, so I might as well just tromp through it too. Yeah, right here. That's my why. I stepped in the wrong spot, it's over here. Oh. I always, I always <laughs> hold my <laughs> <laughs> this foot's wet. This one, not yet. But like, you see the water line? <laughs> Fuck. I told you I should have wore rubber boots. <laughs> no, I definitely shouldn't have. <clears throat> but whether I want to or not, we'll be heading out right now because my foot is definitely wet. Oh shit. <laughs> Go ahead. I'm just going to keep I'm gonna keep a bit of a distance. Straight back. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, I, we got enough of an investigation to know we could paddle through this, no problem. Yeah. I'm totally confident in that thought. All right, guys. My foot's fucking wet, number one. <laughs> Aside from that, though, it was a great adventure. A little sketchy for Lynn because of the ice and stuff. A little bit. Tyler just marched through it. But there's a layer of ice, water, and then feet of ice, as always, around here. So you're not really scared of falling through. You're scared of getting a wet fucking foot. But anyways... 
Again, guys, a uh, blast. I'm sure you did too. Oh, fuck, yeah. They also showed up at six this morning and went and did a climb all on their own, which was Lynn's first climb. <laughs> Successful, needed a bit of a help at the end to get out, but not like needed to call for help. He helped her out. <laughs> I've done it with Nick and other people, so it's not a big deal. That's all part of the game. First climb in a spot that was my first climb, so people that know where it is, you're gonna be like, wow, really? Because it's impressive, it is. And she also came and did this whole adventure that you'll see uh, before this clip. And once I decide to put it at the start of the video, I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> that was a problem today too. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video or videos because it's gonna be a lot of clips to put together and I'm gonna milk it. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. And thank you guys for coming. That was awesome. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Oh, yeah. That works for me. <laughs>